what you're saying is that there might be some challenges, but you don't foresee them coming. Yes. I asked a question about the quantum that we need, and do we have that quantum? Okay. Because again, when we get to peak periods, and I said, for example, yesterday I had three outages, shot by the stabbing. Because let's say you're following a program on television, and it goes off. If we don't have a refrigerator guard or TV guard or some guard of a sort, your appliances are going to suffer if you're not home, especially. So, what do we need in terms of quantum? What do we have? Do we have all that we need? Um, I just, you know, I was on the phone with, with um, sub transmission people, mm. um, trying to get the data and everything. Mm. And averagely, we are doing about 400 megawatts for the uh, region, in the whole of the region. Mm. So let me also say that there are five different BSPs, bulk supply points within the entire Ashanti region. Mm. There's one at Konongo, there's one at um, just behind us at Angomaso, just before us. Um, there's a major one at Ridge, and there's one for Dunkwao and then Obwasi. When you put all of that together, we are doing about um, 400 megawatts averagely. Um, the maximum that we've had is about 407. Um, and, you know, constantly we are doing that. <clears throat> is that to say that with the foreigner we have supplies all or we, 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 we do 350 and we have some 50 something, you know, as backup when the need arise? I mean, what, what is the consumption pattern like? Okay, so that's just, I'm, I'm talking about the consumption part, okay. the average, okay. average consumption. So that is the 400, the, the 407. 407 oh, okay. maximum. Yeah, that's okay. the average okay. consumption. Um, in terms of capacity that is sitting at the various uh, um, BSPs, we have you know big uh, higher capacity mm. than whatever that we okay. are consuming. Okay. So, so we're terms, good. We are good. We're good in terms of uh, capacity at the stations. You mentioned yeah, you, mentioned, you mentioned Greco, and there are occasions where outages occur. Sometimes for some period, and the information that we get from the ECGs is, is, is Greco that knocked off some megawatts. Don't they give you heads up? Don't they communicate to you so you're also able to communicate to your customers so we know what is happening rather than being left in the dark? Okay, so um, this is a very important question. And I would say that Gridco and ECG are basically, you know, the same people. Mm. And we are doing virtually the same things. And we have technical meetings all the time. We have technical meetings every, every quarter. Um, to know their consumption pattern, to mm. know their development pattern mm. of, of each each of the companies. Mm. If we if we enjoin our customers to let us know that when they are um, going up in terms of their consumption, we, we are also enjoined to let Gridco know when we are also you know doing some major development within you know our operations. And we have these discussions all the time. Um, we have technical meetings either in our office or in their office. And then, you know, any eminent um, major issue is also discussed. Okay. But the way power behaves is that um, when, you, when you lose some form of um, production, let me put it that way, some form of generation, and you are almost at the peak of generation, there's a possibility that you would lose some bit of your frequency. So the frequency will start dropping. Mm. Now, when the frequency starts dropping, the only thing you have to do is that you have to reduce load. Mm. So you have to probably take some um, loads off. Um, in that particular instance, we understand the system. They also understand that we cannot plunge the entire country into darkness. And then as such that within that particular period, we need to reduce load. Mm. So that is what may happen. But then if it is something that is going to be prolonged or if it's something that is anticipated or they are going to have some major uh, maintenance that requires that we have a setting schedule, that one is actually communicated mm. and then we let our customers also know. So there could be these uh, isolated cases of dumping, what we call dumping. But don't you have system. a WhatsApp platform where you can quickly, they can quickly tell you the challenge they have and place it on the platform and then you can also communicate the same to us? Um, sometimes you have to, there's a platforms are there. They, we are on the same platforms with the operators. The various operators are on the same platform. Mm. And then it's actually communicated. It's communicated above our heads as well. Okay. The various CEOs are mm. aware. The various uh, communication directors are aware okay. of what could be. Before it trickles down. Before it actually comes down. <laughs> <laughs> so so, so definitely, definitely we'll, we'll be in the dark for some time. Where mm. are we with Ameri? Because I've heard this 